All right, what's going on, boys? Today, I have an awesome video for you guys today. So, Raven Software did a playlist update a few days ago, and they added the Resurgence um, Supreme game mode. Now, what this is, is it's basically a Iron Trails version of Rebirth. Well, kind of. It's like more health, but not as much as Iron Trails, and meta weapons are on the floor. You can also purchase Specialist in the buy station for 7,500 and overall it's just a very awesome mode this is probably the most fun i've had playing rebirth in a very long time and as of recording this video i've been playing the mode all day i've got like 24 23 wins or something today alone i've been absolutely fragging out so they also added a brand new calling card with this mode now we come over to customization and check out the calling cards this is the calling card that you get if you get a win on this new mode solos duos trios or quads with minimum 15 kills so you have to get 15 kills in this mode and you also have to get a, a victory and you will be rewarded with this calling card in my opinion it's pretty lackluster but it is a reward and it is a calling card that not many people are going to have because this is probably one of the most skill based calling cards that we've probably had inside of warzone so yeah, hope you enjoyed the video. This is a 25 kill solo win on the new mode. And yeah, hope you guys enjoy. Leave a like, subscribe if you're new. I'll catch you in this one. Peace. I mean, when you're shooting people, when you're in a competitive setting, and you're facing against actual good players. Like whenever I used to play S and D, when I used to play S and D, bro, bro, you never seen anybody run past like you. Max sense, yeah, you can gun all the shit kids on Max sense. Fair enough. But when it comes to actual good players and being consistent. Like, being consistent against shitters, is it, it is what it is, right? Playing pubs. But being consistent against... Being consistent against good players is, uh... Is another thing. I think... I think, personally, I think you're gonna see a lot of big streamers lower their sensitivities when it comes to, uh, ranked... When it comes to ranked, when ranked mode comes out... You're going to see a lot of people lower their sensitivities. A lot. I know for a fact you will. Different ball game. It's a different ball game when you're playing against a full lobby who can shoot back. And not just 2.5 KD rebirth demons. I mean actual people like me. Like 4, four plus KD players who've been playing this shit for a long time and... In, in, in a ranked setting, you're not you're not running around on max sense killing people like that. It's just you're just not doing it. Like you're just not doing it. There's people who play max sense on Apex, right? Like competitive Apex. There's people who play max sense on Apex. But they run a low ADS to, 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 to compensate for it. Majority of pros... Majority, majority of pros on Apex controller run 3-3 three, three or 4-3. Three. I mean, that just goes to show you, like... They run 4-3 or 3-4. Three, or 3-3. Three, three. Three, three. They never go above, like, 4 cents. I'm sure some of them do, but majority don't, right? But it's all about staying consistent when you're when you're when when you're at that level. Bit different playing pubs. It's a little bit different playing pubs when you're when you're like going up against people. When you're going up against people with like not K not point KDs in pubs, it's like, dude. I mean, that's horrendous. Even even in my opinion, this is just my opinion, but a 2KD and a BR is horrible as well. That's just my opinion, though. That's just my opinion. 
a 2 KD and a Battle Royale game is ridiculous. I mean, you average two kills a game. Like, that is bad, bro. My KD is awful, too. Don't get me wrong. For, for my skill level, my KD is bad. But that's because, like, the first half of the game, I was playing strictly for content, right? L laying in bushes, like... Gas is moving in. Like, what? New safe zone highlighted. Jesus Christ. I was laying in bushes for the first fucking year of this game. Enemy soldier nearby. Look at FIFA kill. FIFA kill is one of the best players in the world. Probably like one of the most consistent. One of the most consistent players in the world, probably the most consistent player on controller, and he runs a lower sensitivity than I do. He won the solo dolo tourney, right? He's he's on a lower sensitivity than I am. Which is ridiculous. That's ridiculous. Five five is probably almost on that. He doesn't play five five. Well, I guess five five one eighty s. We'd be all right. He plays on six six, the same as me, but his ADS sense is lower. He plays on zero point six five instead of zero point seven five, and he's one of the most consistent players I've I've seen. On, on Warzone. Obviously, those settings aren't good for multiplayer. It's com it's a completely different ball game on multiplayer, right? It's all about being as fast as possible on multi. And the time to kill is so high on multi where you can get away with really high sense, like max. You can get away with max sensitivity on multiplayer because the time to kill is so fast, right? That's why a lot of the multiplayer pub stompers are on max sense. Because it's really beneficial to play max sense on multiplayer. It's mainly about your tracking. And your movement. You're being tracked by an enemy team. Tread carefully. Prices are back to normal soon. Enemy dropping into the AI. Can you make this one a video, please? Yeah, I got you. If I win. Cristo Dio, Cristo Dio, Cristo. Appreciate that, bro. That's really kind. Wow. Yeah. 
objective is to eliminate the bounty target. Gas is closing in. Relocating the safe zone. You're in the top five, but don't get comfortable. The bounty target is down. Marvelous. This guy has a satchel. No plates, though. Mission accomplished. All targets eliminated. GG.